From towering skyscrapers to enormous real estate developments, these projects pushed the boundaries of what we thought possible. And that's not all. They also include massive rail networks connecting entire continents and a groundbreaking nuclear power plant that will revolutionize the energy landscape. These mega projects are a testament to human ingenuity and creativity, highlighting the resourcefulness and innovation of engineers, architects, and construction workers worldwide. As they near completion, they will leave a lasting impact on the communities they serve and transform the industries they're in. Welcome to our channel. In today's video, we will discover and cover the largest mega projects currently under construction in 2023, covering various industries and sectors. These initiatives are some of the most important and ambitious endeavors happening today. So let's dive in without wasting time. Number 15, the line. Saudi Arabia's economy is shifting towards tourism, leading to the creation of numerous ambitious mega-projects. Among these, the most impressive is Neom, a megacity with a budget of $500 billion. Neom made global headlines last year when it unveiled plans for the line, an unprecedented skyscraper of two 500-meter-tall mirrored walls that would run for 170 kilometers across the desert Many commentators initially doubted that the project would ever come to fruition. The line is expected to accommodate 9 million residents and could welcome its first inhabitants in just 7 years by 2030. Number 14. Eco Atlantic City Moving to Africa, Lagos is currently experiencing the highest rate of urbanization in the world and is set to become even more prominent with the development of a new financial hub worth $6 billion. The city is being constructed on reclaimed land in the Atlantic Ocean and will feature a range of facilities such as skyscrapers, luxury residences, and shopping malls. Although some buildings are yet to be constructed, the city already boasts an extensive road network and has secured contracts with major financial institutions worldwide. One notable development is the approval of the United States to construct a new consulate in Eco-Atlantic, which is expected to cost around $500 million. Number 13. Nusantara Indonesia is embarking on a massive undertaking to establish a new capital city on a more central island, situated almost 2,000 kilometers away from Jakarta. The ambitious project, known as Nusantara, is the brainchild of the outgoing president, Joko Widodo, who has set a target to complete the first phase before Indonesian Independence Day in 2024. The need for a new capital city arises from Jakarta's current challenges such as overcrowding, pollution, and the rapid sinking to the city due to excessive groundwater extraction. Most of the financing will be coming from the private entities. And that's around, well, over 3 million residents as well. And it's slated for a completion in 2045. Number 12, Merdeka Tower. Malaysia is making good progress towards opening the Merdeka Tower, the world's second largest skyscraper, which is expected to take place in mid of 2023. A high-ranking official has confirmed that the tower's construction has reached 92% completion, making the mid-2023 timeline a realistic goal. With a towering height of 678 meters, the Merdeka Tower surpassed Shanghai Tower last year to become the second tallest building in the world. Kuala Lumpur, Malaysia's largest city, is already home to famous super tall skyscrapers such as the Exchange 106 and the Petronas Twin Towers. In addition to the Merdeka Tower, further elevates the city's skyline, making it one of the most iconic in the world. Number 11, Doha Metro. Qatar made headlines for more than just hosting the FIFA World Cup recently. The Doha Metro played a prominent role during the event transporting football fans between stadiums every three minutes on its 76 kilometers rail network. Metrolink 37 stations of train, of course, connecting five of the eight World Cup stadiums, and a staggering 18 million passengers used the network during the event. Without the Metro, the event may have been, well, it may have not been possible in its current form. However, the work on the Metro isn't finished yet. After starting construction 10 years ago, the Metro will move into its next phase with plans to add 60 more stations in the following year. Number 10, Incheon International Airport. As part of Australia's progress, South Korea's Incheon 
As part of the Australia's progress, South Korea's Ishiyan International Airport, one of the busiest airports globally, is set to have a more significant role in the future. The airport is undergoing phase 4 of a planned upgrade that will transform it into one of the world's largest airports with a $4 billion investment. The expansion of Terminal 2 is a significant addition that will boost the airport's capacity to handle up to 106 million passengers annually. The final construction phase is in progress and is expected to be completed by 2024. Number 9. Hudson Yard The Hudson Yard's development in New York has been in the works for 30 years and is now the most significant addition to the city since the Rockefeller Center in the 1930s. It is located on a previously underdeveloped parcel of land near the Hudson River and covers an area equivalent to four city blocks. The first phase, completed in 2019, includes four skyscrapers, residential buildings, and an impressive art installation called a vessel. It is scheduled for completion by 2024 with the project's total cost estimated at $25 billion. Number 8. Frankfurt Frankfurt is now known for the skyscraper capital of Europe, with more than 50 high-rise buildings currently in development. One of the most exciting projects in the Frankfurt 4 complex, which consists of four skyscrapers, will be completed in 2023. The tallest tower will be 233 meters high, which... Well, while the other three will be over 100 meters tall, Frankfurt 4 project has already reached its structural completion and will open by the end of this year. But this is just the beginning of Frankfurt's skyscraper boom as even taller buildings are planned, such as a Millennium Tower. It will reach a height of 288 meters and break ground in the next two years. Number 7. Iconic Tower in 2023, the iconic Tower of Egypt will be completed, setting a new record as the tallest building in Africa and the continent's first super-tall skyscraper with a towering height of 393 meters. Despite the challenges proposed by the pandemic, the construction of this massive structure has been remarkable swift, taking less than five years to complete. It is expected to be finished by the mid-year and will serve as the focal point of Egypt's new administrative capital. Number 6. The Brenner Base The next big tunnel project on the horizon is one of the world's longest and it's happening in Europe. The Brenner Base Tunnel will be 64 kilometers long and run under the Alps to connect Italy and Germany via Austria. This railway network has been placed for 150 years, but due to high elevation and steep slope gradient, the journey across the region is slow, with speeds never exceeding 70 km per hour. The project is estimated to cost over $10 billion, and after tunneling is completed by 2025, it will take another 7 years for the rail networks to open. Number 5. Chuo Shinkansen In the realm of the rail systems, Japan takes pride in having one of the most advanced in the world. Back in 2014, they took a step further by initiating plans for the Maglev High Speed Rail Project, which employs a concept of magnetic levitation, which employs the concept of magnetic levitation to double the speed of current bullet trains. Even with the most route traversing mountains and 90% of its tunneling, the construction as of 2023 is progressing faster than expected. If this momentum continues, the first passengers can experience the Maglev train by 2027. The project will span a 285km distance between Tokyo and Nagoya, costing approximately $55 billion. Number 4. Flamenwheel 3 Apart from towering skyscrapers and colossal transit megaprojects, Europe is also fast-tracking the development of nuclear power megaprojects to keep up with the increasing energy and the demands of the population. The French state-owned energy company EDF is working on a upgraded nuclear reactor that is more efficient and has a longer lifespan to replace its outdated fleet and enhance France's nuclear exports. Nevertheless, the Flamwheel 3 EPR project Valued at $3 billion is over a decade behind schedule and significantly over budget. Construction started in Normandy in 2007 with an expected launch date of 2023. But it costs, well, $14 billion, so you can see the delay. However, the repair work is also progressing slower than expected. As a result of these recent developments, the flammable plant will not begin generating electricity until the first half of 2024. Number 3. Hinkley Point C France is not the only country dealing with nuclear power plant delays as the Hinkley Point C project in Britain has been plagued by years of delays and budget overruns. 
the HPC project, the mega project as I may add, is considered crucial for Britain's future. As the country seeks to stabilize its energy production following the Ukraine conflict and, well, the retirement of its existing power plant fleet. The HPC is expected to provide 7% of the UK's clean energy needs for the next six decades and generate enough power to supply 6 million households. However, the new nuclear power station is not slated to begin operations until 2027, and the cost estimates have risen from 20 billion to 30 billion over the last seven years. Number two, ITER. Scientists worldwide are working on creating a sustained fusion reaction that will generate more energy than today's fission reactors without producing any greenhouse effects and with significantly lower and shorter radioactivity. To achieve this, several different approaches are being tested, including the $22 billion International Thermonuclear Experimental Reactor, currently underway in the south of France. The construction of ITER is being funded by the European Union, China, India, Japan, South Korea, Russia, and the USA, with the EU covering half of the cost. In 2022, scientists achieved significant breakthroughs in fission reaction in China the EU, and the United States. Although ITER is an experimental reactor, there's still so much to be excited about. Providing the concept could lead to an entirely new energy generation method. Number one, New Silk Road. As China's Belt Road Initiative approaches its 10th anniversary in 2023, it continues to achieve new milestones. $62 billion China-Pakistan Economic Corridor is considered the flagship new project under BRI. And this year, we'll see the completion of the Gwadar International Airport in Pakistan. Additionally, a $6 billion upgrade to a 1,600-kilometer rail track between Karachi and Peshawar is in the works, which will allow trains to double their current speeds up to 160 kilometers per hour. In the West, China's New Silk Road is seen as the economic endeavor and a strategic one. Countries inviting investment opportunities from China are constantly warned of the debt trap, and calls for transparency are growing louder. As we look into ahead into 2023, the world is buzzing with excitement over the biggest mega projects set to change the landscape of our planet. From space exploration to sustainable energy and transportation, these projects promise to push the boundaries of innovation and reshape our future. That's all for today. Thank you so much for watching and don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more upcoming amazing videos.